Namibia will send about 32 athletes to represent the nation at this year's Birmingham Commonwealth Games. Among the athletes are new faces that are confident ahead of their first appearance at the Commonwealth Games. Emilia Ekanjo is looking forward to rub shoulders with the best in the world as she makes her debut at the Games. What I'll be wanting to achieve is just to get exposure and to learn more about um, the sports that I do and to learn from other gymnasts as well and see their training or if I could get tips as well. I hope to make um, our country proud and that we can um, be confident in this. Romeo Goliath, who also appeared on Intersport, said the preparation is going well and mental strength is key going into these games. I'm very excited for the games. It's my first, ga first games, mm -hmm. competing at a high level. I'm very excited to compete with the world's best. Uh, hopefully I'm going to comp compete against my idol. And also, um, I'm very excited to compete amongst the Namibia's best, such as my role model, such as Jonas Juniors. And also, he doesn't know it, Ananias is also my role model. And I'm going with him, so uh, we're preparing on our mental state as well. So mm -hmm. I'm, I'm going to ask for some few pointers from Ananias on how to get my mental game right for the games. I'm really excited. I've been waiting for this opportunity my whole life. I've dreamed of competing internationally since I was very young and I just want to go and make Namibia proud. I want to see some of the Australian gymnasts that I've watched and I would actually really love to be on the podium next to them. So I'm going to fight hard to be able to make Namibia proud. Team Namibia will travel in groups and the first group will leave on Wednesday the 20th of July followed by the second and third groups on the 22nd and 24th of July respectively. With over 5,000 athletes expected at the Commonwealth Games in Birmingham, the stage is set for the opening ceremony on Thursday, 28 July, while the closing ceremony will take place on the 8th of August, 2022. Michael Ditu, NBC Sport.